hiding behind my fairy stains, because the day you do, it'll be the end of us. But I want to know what you look like. I told you, the day you see behind my fairy stains is the day we part for good. Well, what's your name? Uh-uh. Let's keep it like we got, with no names. It's more fun. This is the way love ought to be, the way I like it. You here, and my wife down there, and... What? I've been offered an heiress. Trouble is, she's not being cross-eyed. Her brain don't work so right. What you marry her for, then? She's got riches. I'm considering this strictly a business deal. I figure I'll marry her and love with you. What does that make me, then? What's that make you? That makes you my lover. <gasps> I like it like that. Yeah, you came in! Oh, uh, Mr. Musgrove, I know it ain't Wednesday yet, but I've been putting out a lot of energy lately, thinking. And I got happy news. I think it'll be just fine for me to marry your daughter. So just let me avenge your honor with that beast. Should take me from today and tomorrow with the boat. And any time after that, it's fine for the wedding day. Can't be too soon for me. Now, where's my little guy? Oh, God, Jamie, the beast stole her away for good. She's kidnapped <laughs> and hanging off. Oh, I can't stand it. My little girl. Well, you love her just as much as I do, Jamie, don't you? Well, if you can get my little girl back, your bride, I'll give you half of everything I own. She's right. This is no time to be stingy. I'll give you everything. Everything? Agreed. I'll buy it. By tonight, your girl will be in your arms. Don't take on so much trouble. Yeah. Your little girl will be back before you know it. Let me do my grief alone.
cute of his. Look what I broke you. Uh-uh. Oh, Daddy doesn't care. Oh, quit dithering, sugar. You think I want you back? What well, for when I've been trying to get rid of you ever since I got there? What you here for then? I came to make sure you're here permanent. Yeah. 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 Is he good to you? The painted of the woods is a wonderful parader. Every day he brings me home a new stolen treasure, and every night our love continues. My goodness, honey. You sound so happy. I noticed you call the band in the woods. What's his real name? I'm not supposed to say. Then what's it look like? I promised I wouldn't tell. Rosamond, this is your stepmother, Salome, talking. You can't fool me. You've never seen his face and you don't know his name. He never takes the fairy stains off. Rosamond, how can you love a man that won't even give you the common courtesy to let you see his face? Uh, don't you want to see? Just a little peek. He says as soon as I see under the fairy stain, the end of oh, sugar baby, let me help you. You can? Well, I have to have a perfectly wonderful recipe for removing berry stain. You do, but he said that. Oh, that's just talk. Now, get you three fresh duck eggs, break them in clear rainwater, and stir them up, but not too much. Add in a pinch of red pepper, some saffron, a little room, pour in a pint jar of plum vinegar. Turn it all up till it foams, rub it on nice and easy like, and those stains will come right off. Did you say sage? No, saffron sugar and duck eggs. Now, I think I saw ducks setting out on my pond on my way over here. Stepmother, why have we always been such enemies? I don't know. Waste the energy, I guess. Rosalind, I'd like you to call me mother. Thank you. Mother? Now, you go get them duck eggs. Thank you, mother. I knew she was done like her daddy. She's going to take them stains off the band in the woods, and he'll run out on her forever. Maybe you'll smash her and I won't have to think about that snippy little thing anymore. All right. This must be Jamie Lockhart's house. He stole my girl. Now I'm going to get his. You know what? I'm going to do worse than just get her. I'm going to put Jamie Lockhart's girl in this sack and throw her into the ravine. Turn back, my body. Turn away, all. Some fine feathered friend. Last time someone turns their back on the little party. Get this dead bird out of here! That must be the girl. I hear she's young and juicy. Hey there, young and juicy! Hey there yourself! Are you the bandit of the woods? Are you Jamie Lockhart's girl? Lord, he's got a good. Peculiar taste, to say the least. <laughs> well, this must be his house then. It ain't. This is where the bandit of the woods lives. Get going. This is the place. You can't fool me. I saw two faces sitting on the same man's head, and I know for a fact that Jamie Lockhart and the bandit of the woods are one and the same person. How do you know that? I saw the bandit with the stains off, and it's Jamie Lockhart in the name. Oh my god, Jamie Lockhart's the bandit of the woods. What do you want then? I want his girl. What fur? Jamie is sick fur. What fur? Don't make love to her out in the woods. He does? Well. On a pine needle floor with nothing but the bugs and the birds and the varmint to watch. I'm the girl you're looking for. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. I don't want to make no mistakes. Well, I'm living in this house, ain't I? All right, get in the sack. Get in the sack. That was his orders, and that's the way he wants to see his loverly. He's probably waiting there right now, pawing the ground. Coming, Salome! I'm coming! He's coming! Bye, Salome!
Where's my knife? <laughs> <laughs> You're a coward! <laughs> <laughs> there! There's my knife! Evening. Evening. You look poorly. I ain't never killed nobody before. <laughs> Nothing went right today. I lost my heiress. Your precious lane right. Good job, I can't find her anywhere. The heart must be broken if the cake comes over her. I want those riches for you and me. Listen, you can't do anything about it now. You got time for a little nap before supper? I don't need no nap. Sure you do. Come on. Now.
I could die Just like a poor set of fly I could shrivel up and die from my soul
I steal with style. We have a beautiful house right on Lake Pontray. Marble and sapphires. Sky blue candy over the bed. And I have 84 dresses. Oh, baby, is that all true? Oh, with the blue canopy. I don't know where she got that from. Stay with us, Daddy. Oh, I really wish I could, but I don't belong here. I'm needed back up on the plantation. Uh, Jamie, I better get you that money soon, shouldn't I? I got plenty of money now. Well, then at least buy that uh, blue canopy and sit with me. All aboard! Well, sugar pie, looks like that's my boat. Take care of yourself, will you? I will, I promise. But when you get a chance to talk, Daddy, I want to know about home. How slowly. Oh, she's fine. She's dead. Yes, because I need your car tomorrow. 